now 23 years since Melanie Hall was murdered, but for her parents, the pain never goes away. It still is raw today as it was 23 years ago. And I don't think people realise that sometimes. The loss of Melanie has been like death by a thousand cuts. And if you lose someone instantly, like a road accident, or even if Melanie had been found 24 hours later, however terrible that is, mm. it has happened and you, you, you take that on board and, and deal, deal with, with it, it as best yes. you can. Whereas with us, it sort of crept up on us. Mm. Melanie's ashes are kept in the family home. Well, it's all we've got of her, really. And, her, and you know, obviously she's still, you know, she's got a bedroom here and everything, but, um, you know... I can't bring her back. And she was such good fun, so. Yeah. Melanie was last seen alive at the Cadillacs nightclub in Bath in June 1996. But it wasn't until October 2009 that her remains were found next to a motorway slip road off the M5 near Thornbury in South Gloucestershire. Police say it's highly likely that whoever left Melanie's body here was familiar with this area. But they say the person who left the body may not be the person who killed Melanie. And if that's the case, they're now appealing for that person to come forward. Police can now reveal that traces of DNA were found on ropes similar to this that was wrapped around bin liners containing Melanie's body. Her parents just want answers. Well, I would just like to know why and how it happened. We honestly believe that eventually we will find Melanie's killers. One day someone will come forward with um, information. Melanie's parents say they remain eternally optimistic that her killer will be found and that one day they will finally have justice. Leila Hayes, Five News.